Hey everybody. Hello. So hopefully you won't hear my kids in the back of this video. Um, but but um I haven't posted in about a month. Um uh, I'm not doing good with posting these videos, but I'm gonna try harder. So I've had um some good weeks and some bad weeks. Um most of my weeks were good where I had a lot of non-scale victories. Um, I, were a, I was able to fit into some size 16 jeans. So I went from an 18 to a 16 so far. Uh, I was able to fit into these, oh, excuse me, mm -mm, into these um, dress pants that I've never been able to fit. Um, the skin on my arms is getting tighter. The, the arms, the... Um, my arms, um, the skin is not as loose. Um, I can tell, I feel, and I look smaller. I can feel my collarbone. You look, you can't see it, but I can feel it. It's right there. I don't have to dig down deep anymore. It's there now. <laughs> and um, what else? My kids are getting lighter. For those who don't know, I have twins, two-year-old twins, and I have to pick them up often. Um, in and out of the car and things of that sort and they have gotten so much lighter so I know like my the muscles in my arm I'm gaining a lot more strength um, in my arms um, but um, with all that said and I've had some other non-scale victories um, but with all that said last week like today is currently February 11th Sunday, February 11th. And last week it was not a good week for me. I literally only worked out twice. I went to the gym two times to do lifting. I did my cardio one time um, this week. And I was so tired this week. Don't know why I was very tired. I was just extremely tired. And I don't know why. So I'm getting back on it actually today. Um, I know I'm bloated and I'm currently on my mother nature. Isn't she wonderful when she comes? Um, but I've been on that before and it hasn't, you know, set me back for any reason. So I don't really know why I was off this week. I was really tired and that sort. But I mean, you know, I'm not going to let it like get me down or stop because of that. Um, I have a goal. I have a goal in mind to make a lifestyle change. And whether I do bad for a week or not, I'm still going to continue on my journey and do well. I'm not going to let that defeat me and get me down and just totally quit. That's No, that's not what I do. That's not what I do. That's not um, in my DNA to give up. I'm very competitive. So <laughs> this will get done. Um, but you know, I, I just had a bad week and I was feeling down and I was like, I can't believe this, and blah, blah, blah. And you know, and, and it's okay to have bad weeks, bad days, bad, whatever, just as long as you get back on the truck and continue doing what you're going to do. And that's the important thing to me that I'm going to finish this. I'm going to do it. Whether I have some good days or some bad days, most of my days have been really good. So I'm just going to continue. I haven't gained any weight other than this bloating this water weight. So that was a blessing, right? Because I actually ate pretty good. Mm, okay, I ate good, but I did have some candy this week because I was craving chocolate. But not like every day. Two days I had some candy and the other days I didn't. But I ate like my food food was good. I ate salads and, you know my eggs and whatever for breakfast. So that was good. Um, so I'm getting back on it. Um, today I'm going to do my cardio today. Can't go to the gym. Um, but I will be there the rest of the week at the gym doing my lifting. Um, and I want to like change up some things. I'm not for sure what I'm going to change up. My bestie wants me to do like, um, shakes with her smoothies not shakes smoothies um smoothies work really well for her i'm more of a vegetable protein you know kind of girl that works really well for my body um 
And I like to chew my food, so <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to do smoothies. I, I kind of want to try, but I still got to go get the stuff if I'm going to do it this week. And then I have to figure out how that's going to work out with my schedule. Because I like prep my foods for the week. Other than maybe prepping it and then freezing my smoothies. Um, I really don't know how I can prep smoothies for the week or at least even for like a couple days. Because I don't like the way they look and taste and all that um, after they've been sitting like in the refrigerator for a day, you know. Um, so, and then it's hard for me to do it daily because of the time I have to get up, got to get my kids ready, got to get out the door. I work out early in the morning. So, I, that's not one thing I want to do and add to my list of things to do in the morning. I'm already like, go, 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 go. Um, I don't want to add that to the list and then I don't make it one day and then I eat bad. I have, I'm a type of person where I have to prepare my stuff. I have to be ready. Uh, it has to be ready. If it's not ready and like, oh, I can just take it and go with like fast food or something, uh, to make it instant that I, mm -mm, I'm not going to do good. Um, it has to be something easy and quick. I can quickly grab it and go. I prep my, um, lunches every night and then i do my breakfast for the week so it's easy for me to just get grab go um i don't have to worry about that in the morning so that'd be something i have to kind of figure out how to do that in the more like how to do those in the morning i don't want to get up any earlier to make smoothies so we'll see if y'all have any suggestions please let me know um what else other than that that's um oh my weight loss so i you know went from I started at 252. Right now I'm currently at 231. Mm, 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 mm. So um, I'm going to get me a size pair of 14 jeans and that'll be my next goal to get into those jeans. And um, we'll see how, you know, how long it takes me or what happens. I would love to be skin man saying by the time um, I get out for the summer. But that's probably not gonna happen. I'm probably very close, but I, I don't know. I have a lot of weight to lose, so I have. I want to get to 170. So I think that's what 60 something, 61 pounds left. I have to lose. If my math's wrong, excuse me. I'm trying to do it on top of my head. Um. So we'll see what happens. I want to, um, you know, get to that before summer and it could be very well possible i just have to like for real like work hard and do what i need to do and if i'm not there then i know i can be very close to it so anyways if you guys have any suggestions for like workouts um how i can shed some more of this weight a little quick i know it's a slow and steady um thing so there is like no race. I'm not, you know, that part doesn't discourage me. Um, and also, if you have any like food tips for me that you would like to give me, I would appreciate it. And thank you. And um, that's, that's pretty much it. So I thank you guys for watching and supporting me and helping me through this journey because it's not easy, but it will get done. And um, I'm very blessed. And with God's help, all things are possible. So it's, it's possible. It's going to happen. So thank you for the support, everybody, and all the love. Bye. And I'll see you next time.